Before the 18th century, Sarigankars walked all the way to Nagoya to attend services at the Church of the Most Holy Trinity. This tiresome journey deeply impacted the old and sick of the village as no other transportation was available then. Considering the grievances of the people, Archbishop Don Juan Cristomo de Amori suggested that a church be built right here in Saligon for its people. With the support of the Archbishop, Saligankers met on the 5th of November 1864 and resolved to build a church at the earliest. The location of the church in Temba Modwana was decided upon unanimously due to its central location and easy accessibility from all parts of the village. Hence, Saligao's new church was commissioned to be built with much encouragement and support. This crucial project was spearheaded by Francisco Salvador Zeferino Pinto. With excitement slowly brewing in anticipation of the new church, the Public Works Inspector Major Martins ambitiously drew a unique plan for a neo-Gothic edifice. The project was approved on the 23rd of June 1865, the expenses of which would be borne by the Comunidad of Salica. The foundation stone was laid on the 7th of February where the main altar would be built. The honours were led by the then Vicar General of the Archdiocese, Canon Joaquim Antonio de Rosario. The church was successfully constructed after six years, nine months and 19 days. The church was inaugurated by the parish priest of Panjim Church, Father Domingos Jose Rafael Pinto, on 26 November 1873. The patroness of the church is Maya de Deus. Mother of God. In this honor, the villagers requested the Governor General to bring the statue from Daoji ruins to Saigon. There is an interesting memoir of how the assignment took place. With great anticipation and excitement, the church finally began services with Reverend Father Caetano Xavier de Abreu as the first parish priest. Globally, 1st January was celebrated as the Feast of the Holy Mother of God. But due to many Saligankars residing in different parts of India and the world, it was changed to celebrate it on the first Sunday in the month.